What's up guys, Ricky Kruth here coming at you with three real estate mindsets that I think every real estate agent should adopt, okay? And I'm hoping at least some of you pick up one or two of these and take it with you and go crush it in your market. These three real estate mindsets are gonna take you above all the other agents. It's gonna separate you and differentiate you in the market. They're also gonna give you so much confidence in yourself and in your business, and it's gonna put you in a position where you cannot lose in this business. Y'all ready for this? Let's go. If this is your first time seeing me, I'm Ricky Carruth, I'm a 17 year real estate agent and I'm the very first completely free real estate coach. All my training can be found at zerotodiamond.com. Link is in the description for that. And I do live training twice a month right here on this YouTube channel. So click subscribe and hit the bell so you can get notified every time I post a new video and every time we do a live training session. We're now over 10,000 real estate agents in the Zero to Diamond free coaching program. And it's incredible. I'm getting messages every day from agents saying, and they were about to have to quit the business until they found me somewhere online and started applying the same exact principles I'm about to share with you right here in this video. So the first real estate mindset that I wanna share with you today is that business is 110% unlimited for every single agent and competition does not exist. Okay, so let me dive into that for a second. Business is completely unlimited. There's no way that any one agent can do all the business out there. Being unlimited means this, that there's more than any one agent can handle at any given time for the rest of their life. Okay, and because of that, it creates a situation where there's zero competition. Since I've been coaching real estate agents for free, I've been sending emails daily to my entire coaching program and all my agents. I added every single agent in my MLS to that group over two years ago. I'm teaching all the agents in my county exactly everything I do step by step to sell 100 properties a year every single year for five years straight as a single agent. And I haven't lost one single client. I haven't even had a client come to me and say, hey, this guy sounds like you or this guy's sending me a weekly email that looks a lot like yours. Nothing, okay? It's because of two reasons. One. Nobody's really gonna do it, okay? You can teach everybody everything you wanna teach them and very few people actually follow through and do the actions. Take what you say and turn it into something. But the second fact is that even if every single agent did do my plan and follow the steps, the nine day action plan, the live trainings, and took all my philosophies and applied them to their business, it still would not matter at all. Business is completely unlimited. You cannot do it all. Another, just to take it a step further and give you guys some actual tactical information, you can't call all the property owners in your area ever. You cannot call every single owner ever in your life. And if you did, by some miracle or some weird, you know, you hired five or six a uh, ISAs and put them in a room and made them work, you know, 10 hours a day for three or four years, if you got through all those people, you would have to turn right around and call them all over again because 60% of those properties have changed hands. 40%, 30%, 20%, 80% have changed hands. On top of the fact, let's take it a step further, that if you call a property owner and they tell you they wanna do this or don't wanna do that today, you could call them back tomorrow and they may have changed their minds. Not to mention next week, next month, next year, people are constantly changing their minds on what they wanna do, how they wanna do it. It creates a situation where business is completely unlimited. The second real estate mindset that I wanna share with you today is that closings happen every single day forever. Okay, and this is regardless of market conditions. And this is one of the big takeaways that, that I took away from when the market crashed on me and I lost everything I had. Okay, after doing all my research and reading and figuring everything out, I realized that closings never stopped. Closings continue to happen every single day, and what do I need? I need one a month, two a month, three a month, four a month. Okay, I don't need one every day, but they're, they're available every day. And remember, every closing is worth two prospects. There's a buyer and a seller. There's two opportunities to represent a client in that transaction. So for every deal that closes, there's actually two opportunities for you to represent somebody. Let's say in your market, there's only 50 transactions a day. 
okay? It varies. There's, there's places that have thousands of transactions. There's places that have 10 or 20. Let's just say 50, that your market has 50 closings every day, okay? Those 50 closings represent 100 clients that you could possibly represent. Okay, let's say the market really crashes really hard and goes down 90%. That would be really crazy if, if, the, if the market crashed and, and transactions went down 90%. Okay, it goes down from 100 a day to 10 a day. There's still 10 people every single day, okay, that are closing deals. These aren't people that have just made offers to try to negotiate. These aren't listings that are being signed. These are agreed upon purchase agreements that people have negotiated and came to terms and signed those purchase agreements to close in 30 days, 40 days, 10 days, whatever the case may be. Every single day, people are agreeing on contracts and signing to, to close on properties in the, in the near future. So do not look at any situation as that there's not enough business to go around, that there's only so many closings and you know these agents over here that are producing so much, they, they, they're gonna get all that business and there's not gonna be anything left for me. Not true. Your personality is what separates you from all the other agents out there. Use your personality as your strength to get out there, to meet people, to talk to people, and follow my program to learn how to communicate with people, to get out there and get yours. And the third real estate mindset that I want to share with you today is you have to, you have to value relationships with your clients and prospects over transactions and the money and the deals and the contracts and the listings. You have to value relationships over transactions. If you really want to go big in this business, you have to take every single prospect that regardless if they want to buy or sell something today, next week, next month, you have to create that lifelong relationship with them and then maintain that relationship through some sort of technology. I do it through a weekly email. But you have to create, they have to really feel that you care about them regardless if they do a deal or not. And you want to create that and maintain it for the rest of your life. You accumulate these clients over time and you build a huge database of people who know you, love you, trust you. And now we have something real. Now we have a real business. Market share is how many real lifelong relationships you have with property owners in your market. Not how many closings or listings that you have compared to the rest of the market, but how many lifelong relationships are you putting in place? Are you cultivating? Are you nurturing? Are you maintaining forever? That's the agent that owns all the future business and thus the market share. Get out there and get your market share by creating not transactions, not listings, but relationships. The relationships will bring you 10 to 20 transactions over the life of your career through repeat business referrals and referrals of referrals. Some of my best clients never even bought a property from me, but they referred five people to me that bought and sold and referred even more people to me. People that never even bought or sold a property with me are some of my best clients. When you do good things, good things come back to you. Treat everyone the way that you would want to be treated. Do not high pressure people. Use my phone scripts. Understand that it's not about asking people if they want to buy or sell or how to get them to sign the line. It's about finding out what you can do to help them regardless if it's to buy or sell something today or not and then creating and maintaining that relationship forever. So these are my three real estate mindsets. Let's go over them. The first one is, is that business is completely unlimited and competition does not exist. The second one is that closings happen every single day forever regardless of market conditions. And the third one is that you always have to value relationships over transactions. Real estate is such a mental game. Even the hard work part of real estate is mental because you have to tell yourself in your mind, I got to keep going, I got to keep pushing, I got to keep making phone calls, I got to keep trying, I got to keep trying to help people every single day. And it could get mentally draining, but when you realize that you can't lose because there's no competition, business is, is unlimited, and closings happen every day, and your job is just to create and maintain lifelong relationships with property owners, not to close deals, as soon as you realize that, everything gets better for you. It's like a weight is lifted off your shoulder and all the pressure is off because now we're not trying to high pressure people because we know that closings are happening every day so we don't have to pressure people into these closings. 
If they like us, if we make them feel comfortable, if we're doing what we're supposed to do, they're gonna do business with us. If there's anything in the world I can do for you, please reach out. What can you do for me? Just get out there and take something I said today and go succeed. Go crush it, go provide for your family, go be the number one agent in your area and let me know about it. Hit me up with an email, an Instagram DM, a comment in this video and let me know that what I'm doing is helping you. We'll talk to you guys soon.